Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and with the 2023 season fast approaching, it's actually starting in the next 24 hours. It's time to go through the predictions of the season for the 2023 season and see how many we get right this time next year. We're going to go through the Grand Slam predictions for the men. Let's go have a look at what you guys picked, and I'll put my picks alongside. So with the Australian Open coming up in a few weeks' time, you guys voted that Novak Djokovic is going to be the Australian Open champion ahead of Nadal and Alcaraz. And that was through a poll on YouTube. And I'm also going with Djokovic. I think that he showed at the end of the last season that when he's on court, he's near unstoppable. And of course, being banned from last year's Australian Open, I think he'll be out for revenge. So we're both going with Djokovic, and he's definitely the favorite to take the trophy. Heading over to the French Open now, and again with a vote on YouTube, you guys picked Nadal just ahead of Djokovic at the French Open next year. And I'm also going with Rafa. It's so hard not to pick Rafa because it's so rare that he actually loses at the French Open. So I think that we're both going with the obvious pick, but also the safe pick. Heading over to Wimbledon now, and this has been dominated by the GOATs over the last couple of decades, and you guys voted Djokovic to win Wimbledon. And I've also voted for Djokovic. It's Again, it's so hard not to pick against the guys who have dominated these tournaments tournaments over the last decade, and Wimbledon seems to be the one that doesn't have random champions. It's always Djokovic, Nadal, or it was Federer when he was playing, so we're both going with Djokovic for this one. Again, probably the safe bet. And the final event of the year being the US Open, which does produce random champions, and you guys are going with Novak Djokovic to win the US Open ahead of Alcaraz and Nadal. Now, this is where I've gone a little different. I've gone Alexander Zverev. After what we saw the last few weeks, and I'm expecting by the time we get to the clay court season, Zverev, if he's healthy, will be back in form. He could well and truly win the US Open and maybe the injury that he had over the last six months will kick him back into gear and want to achieve some glory as guys like Medvedev and Elkris have done in the past. So there they are. They are the predictions for next year. And again, it's so hard on the men's tour to not pick the best players on the planet uh, that have ever played the game. You know, Nadal, Djokovic, until they start losing. And at the slams, we know they don't lose very often. Nadal lost one match at slams last year. Djokovic lost one match at slams last year. And they dominated three of the four slams uh, in total. And we haven't had a season where they haven't. So until that happens, we're going to keep picking them. But they're the predictions for that. Let me know down in the comments below if you don't agree with those predictions. Maybe who you think is going to win the US Open because that does produce random champions. Uh, you know, not too many people would have picked Alcaraz this year to win the US Open. Maybe some of you would have picked other players. But let me know down in the comments below. What are your predictions for the upcoming season?